So I just see that uh, a student pointed out something which I didn't notice about this particular question, which I thought was really, really interesting. So as I was reading this, a homeowner has a problem and uh, et cetera, et cetera, you have to fix it. The plumber fixes it. And 80% of cases, a repair of the part will fix the problem. And this will cost 70. But if the repair does not work, then a new part will have to be bought for 150. And there'll be an additional labor cost of 80 to replace the, uh, the old part with the new part. Find the expected value cost of fixing this problem. Now, I assumed that if the part for 70 euros didn't work, then they don't have to pay the 70 euros and they just pay the 150 for the, the other part plus 80. But it's not clear because I assume this old part is the broken part and this additional labor cost 80 uh, is on top of the 150. But maybe you still have to pay that 70 in this scenario. That would change things a bit, all right. Recalculating it, that would be 116. That's really good observation. Uh, I don't know. I really don't know. I, I, I think the English could have been better here. I think just because of the word additional, I might opt for this answer. But I feel like if I was doing this question as a student, I would have missed that because I, I did just miss it. And yeah, okay, that's, that's quite unclear. I think that was very unfair.